So let me just be the first to say I have no idea where 2015 went, but it flew by. Lots happened, it was an exciting year, and here we are in the first official work week, I guess you could call it, of 2016. Lots of cool stuff to talk about. Uh, I wanted to talk a little bit about some of my morning routine stuff, what I do as a trader, how I get myself ready for the day, uh, all of that stuff. So let's dig right in. So this is a bit of the morning routine. It's just a few minutes after 5 a.m. Uh, been up for about an hour, maybe a little more than an hour. Um, and my morning routine is probably my favorite part of the day. I totally love it. I, I think early mornings are great. You can see that it's pitch black outside. Um, this right here is, that's that's the window. That's the outside window there. Um, by the way, I'm in the, the mobile office, or what we like to call the RV. It's nice and early. I'm wearing my Hugh Hefner smoking jacket, because we gotta keep warm. So I've done a little bit of the morning routine, and it's been pretty excellent. Uh, and so, my morning routine consists of doing some early morning meditating, which which was actually kind of hard when I first started doing it because I would get up in the morning and it'd be like 4 a.m. and I'm half asleep and I would start doing some meditating. And you can imagine what happens if you're in a maybe a dark, quiet area at 4 o'clock in the morning with your eyes closed trying to concentrate. Uh, pretty easy to fall asleep. So... Uh, so it took a little bit of getting used to, but it's so great. It's it's the only way I can start my day is by just even a couple of minutes of meditating. All I do is is 10 or 15 minutes of uh, meditating in the morning, and it is so powerful. It really centers my brain and my concentration for the day. I don't know if you guys have this same thing, but my mind is constantly in like 80 different places, and when I meditate... It's in like 70 different places, but I'm slowly being able to bring it down and really focus it in. And it has really uh, focused me. It's, it's really got me a, a much more intense focus, and it's been so awesome. Holy smokes. People have told me about meditating for so long. We've heard about it for so long. It's thousands of years old. It's not like it's anything new. And I'm finally just getting a grip on how powerful and how great it really is. So... And then I spend a couple of minutes in the morning um, writing in my, my gratitude journal, which is basically I just try to write down. I think writing is so powerful. It's so powerful. Uh, so I just write down a couple of things that I'm, that I'm grateful for, whatever those things are. Um, I write down uh, um, you know, two or three or four items of things that, that, I'm, that I'm thankful for for the day. And it really just kind of helps me remember uh, all the all the good stuff that is really happening in my life. We've all got so many good things happening, and I think we kind of, it's easy to forget about that stuff. It was really easy for me to forget about it. It was really easy for me to uh, be stressed out and worried and uh, and constantly busy with work and kids and life and, and really just to forget the great things in my life. Um, and so, so that's such a solid part of my morning routine. So that's just part of it. A little meditating, a little uh, writing down things I'm thankful for, and... Now it's time to pour over the charts and see if we can make some dollar bills this morning. So, looking forward to that. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Very good morning. Good morning. Nice to see everybody. Um, and very good points everyone's bringing up here. It's gonna be uh, it's gonna be an interesting morning today with all the interest rate news. So good to see you guys, Simon. Great to see you and Tom and and Gerard and. Lilla, Damien, everyone, nice to see everyone. Happy, happy morning to you all. It's going to be a wild and crazy one. Uh, interest rate news is coming out today. I think the market will be as surprised as ever by what happens. There, there's such an expectation of something, and whenever there's high expectations, there's usually a surprise. <laughs> so... And the morning jog. Oh man, I don't know about these. <laughs> Little rough. <laughs> About 
but keeps the blood flowing. Love a little exercise in the morning. Oh. And the view, well, you can't really beat it. Okay, finishing this morning's run. Nice little two and a half mile run on the beach. And uh, now headed back home to finish up the final, the final stretch. So, do a couple of push-ups before I run, a couple after. Just kind of make sure the blood's flowing really good. But uh, then it's back to the charts. It's back to work, back to the computer, back to a lot of sitting down. So exercise has become a super crucial part of my morning routine because the amount of sitting I do is probably gonna cut 20 years off my life. So if I run, at least I'll be probably back to break even. Maybe a little bit better, we can only hope. But off to a couple of push-ups right now. So that's a little preview of my morning routine, some of my favorite things to do in the morning. Um, there's more coming, there's a few things uh, throughout the day that I love to do that I think are super helpful, so another video on that is coming. Uh, but this is kind of how I start my morning off. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and maybe you can incorporate a couple of these things into your day, and if you do, I hope they're amazing for you. Thanks for watching.